visitors to this exhibit will see an amazing array of paintings by Matisse and Renoir, some of their most iconic works, including Matisse's Joy of Life, his music lesson, and we have Renoir's work from his Impressionist period through his late works to these late, sensual, beautiful, very warm tone portraits of women. Well, certainly Dr. Barnes's collection inspired this exhibit. He collected Matisse and Renoir in depth and voraciously over 40 years. So we had an incredible amount of paintings and works of art to choose from to create this special exhibition for our visitors. The Barnes collection has the largest collection of Renoir's work in the world. We have 181 in total. And we have one of the largest, most important Matisse collections in the world too, with 59 works by Matisse. World War I was a personally very difficult time for these artists as they both had sons fighting in the conflict. Actually, Renoir's son, Jean, was, was injured, was shot in World War I, and then came home and convalesced. It was a very scary time for Renoir. And Matisse also had a son who was in the conflict. I think Renoir is much more known as an Impressionist, but in the early 20th century, all of the avant-garde artists admired his late work and really took many lessons from the way he used color, from his brushwork, from his layers of glazing, from his painting of flesh. It helped them reimagine the way they did figure painting also. Anyone visiting the exhibition can read their stories simply with a device such as a phone. So all you do is you enter barnesfoc.us, so Barnes Focus. You look for one of the labels with one of these icons indicating it's a digital guide compatible piece. You take your phone, hold it in front of the art bar, give your camera access to the image. And then you have the image popping up with its corresponding story by one of our colleagues. It's just an opportunity for us to really highlight the diversity of voices and perspectives at the Barnes. We have an amazing array of programs coming up this summer in conjunction with the exhibition. So please check out our website.